G'day viewers and welcome to Australia where it's obviously night time because it's dark and there's crickets chirping. Uh, what I've got here is my Tesla Model S. Um, I received a notification to say that the, there's a factory recall because uh, there's been a couple of incidents where the, the bonnet as we call it in Australia or the uh, hood has flown open on a couple of cars while they've been driving along and it was due to the secondary latch, safety latch on the bonnet not engaging properly. So what I'll do, um, I'll unlock the, the hood and I'll just show you in here. At the front here there's a primary latch and then there's a secondary latch behind there. The primary latch is the thing that actually holds the bonnet fully closed and the secondary latch is the safety latch to prevent it from opening if the primary latch for some reason lets go. So what I can do to check it is I can lock the car and you will see that latch comes across. That's spring loaded and so when I lower the, the hood down that will engage and I've only just let the hood go. I haven't fully closed it, so you can see it's actually working. And if I lift it quietly, you can hear it's not touching at all on the striker. So I know, I'm pretty sure that it's working correctly. I'll open it again. And you can also see on the striker, the front, uh, the primary latch hits there where the paint is missing. And the secondary latch hits there but I want to make sure that there is still clearance between the back of the striker and the latch to make sure that there's nothing going to bind the secondary latch from going behind the striker and holding onto it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a little bit of putty. So we call it in Australia, the brand name is Blue Tack. Um, the type of putty that you stick on your walls to hold posters onto the wall. Uh, so I've left it, I've stuck it on there, so I've put it in the corner and left a little bit of thickness to it there so I can tell if there's um, a gap between the striker and the, and the latch. So what I'll do, once again, I'll lock the car, make that latch come across, then I'll grab the hood and lower it down until it goes in behind there and lift it up then I'll undo open up the hood again and so I'm putting my fingers in front of the camera so you can probably see there's a little bit of thickness to the putty so I know there's actually a gap between the back of the hook and the front of the striker so um, yeah I, I I know that there's actually a little bit of clearance here and it's got, not going to bind up and, and not fully latch up. So that's an easy way to check for a, a clearance gap between something. Um, if it wasn't, at the moment it's retracted. If it wasn't working, what you would get is you could lower the bonnet and you could just lift it up again. So if it is working, Obviously, you can lower the bonnet, the secondary latch will catch and you know that it's stopping the hood from opening. And then, obviously, you can fully close it and it's locked. Okay, hopefully that helps you guys. See you later.